Hey YouTube, it's Mr. North 14 and today I'm going to show you a simple fix to fix any issue that you may have with your Fitbit Charge 3. Okay, so you're like, why am I putting this out? The reason why I'm putting this out is because I was just recently on the internet looking for information about the Charge 4. Okay, it's supposed to be coming out soon and it's supposed to add GPS and I wanted to know if I wanted to get it or not just for them adding GPS. Okay, so as I'm looking at and trying to find information, I see reviews of the Charge 3. Now, I swear by this thing. I love the Charge 3. I think it has a simple interface and it gives you so much information and with the ability of the app, can do so many things and give you so much information. So I'm like, why am I seeing all these one and two stars instead of fives and fours on this thing? And so I'm reading it and people are saying that the screen is turning black and they can't get it to work, that it's freezing, that they can't sync it. And I'm like, oh my gosh, all these people are complaining about a simple fix that only takes a few seconds to do and it will fix any charge three. Okay, so I'm gonna show this to you. I'm gonna show you why it's so quick, why it's so easy. And I realized what the problem was is that when people were finding the solution to fix it, they weren't going back to the YouTube pages or the YouTube videos or the, the written things and saying, hey, this is the fix, this is it. So all I ask is, is if, if this works for you, please come back to the YouTube page and let people know, hey, I like this, this works for me, because this is just the simple fix to everything here. So I'm gonna show you what you do, okay? So, you know the Fitbit here, Charge 3, has this little button on the right right side of, or left side of it that you push in and out and it turns it on and off. Okay, you know it's got a touch screen where you just scroll up and down and everything like that to get to certain spots. Okay, so turn it off, grab the power cord that comes with your Fitbit, and connect it. You'll know it's connected, as you saw, you saw the battery thing there. Showed you I got about 80% battery life. This is all you do, once you have it hooked up, you hold this in for about four or five seconds here. And then what will happen is you'll see a smiley face. And once you see that smiley face, you know that everything is good and this bad boy is reset and everything should work after that. Okay, it's not going to erase anything. It's not going to erase your data. All your data is still going to be there. It's just simply going to reset it so that now you won't get any of those issues that you normally have where it was a black screen or it's freezing or it won't sync. So basically, you just click it in here into the power cable, okay? And you hold down that side button that's on the left side of your Fitbit Charge 3. You hold it for about five seconds, and then you're going to see a smiley face. If you don't see the smiley face, then it's not reset. But if you see the smiley face, like I showed you before, it's reset and it's ready to go. I hope this helps everyone. I know it will. All I need you to do is just to come back, like it, so that other people can see this simple fix. And this thing, this great smartwatch or fitness watch, won't be getting, you know, one and two stars when it should only be getting five stars. Because I'm telling you, I use this thing every day and I totally enjoy it. I did a review back on it. Please go check it out. I'm Mr. Nor 14. I hope this works for you. I know it will. You know, and again, please like it so that others can see this and it, you know, and know that this works. Okay. This is Mr. Nor 14. Peace out.